What's going on, YouTube? Got a small uh, gabbo to do. Uh, Collarbone Inspired uh, box open. It's from uh, Pipes and Cigars. I was watching one of his box opens the other day and figured I need to pick me up one of these. It's going to be a Pipe bag, pipe carrying bag. Figured it, I wouldn't leave him out there being the only one taking the merce. But I got a little smaller one that he did. Holds, uh, supposedly holds four pipes, but I've got, uh, my pipes are fairly big, so I don't know if it'll actually hold four pipes in it. It's nice fake leather on it. <laughs> got a nice outside tobacco pouch on it. See the inside. Oh, cool. It's got a little holes for four pipes on the sides of it. I guess that's for your pipe tools and uh or cleaners. It's got another little tobacco pouch on the inside of it. And another pocket. Right here. So since this is a Columbon inspired Gabo. Show you the outside of it real quick. I figured I'd go ahead and do his uh, VR to his 200 subs. Yeah, 200 subs contest. <clears throat> he wanted us to show show us show him uh, our first pipe and uh, our favorite pipe. This is gonna be my first pipe. It's a XLR. They really heard anything about them, and I tried to look them up on the internet. Couldn't find too much about them. Cool little rusticated pipe, though. I really like it. Smokes good. I use it mainly for aromatics because that's what I started smoking uh, when I first started smoking pipe. Uh, as far as my favorite pipe, man, I I won't have to use three because it's kind of like picking you, one of your kids. I, I can't narrow it down to just one, so I've got three of my favorites. It's a uh, Eric Norton freehand. Very cool pipe. Nice grain. Really nice grain on it. I'm hoping it's coming through. This is one that I, uh, I'll tell you a story about it after I show them on. This is going to be my Country Squire Lane uh, second pipe. One that the Country Squire had stamped with their name on it. I never can get that to come through on camera. You may be able to see that. I hope you can. Anyways. And then this is my Lane Sheraton. Lane era Sheraton. Dates back to, I think, about the 1960s. My local tobacconist told me. I may be wrong. If any of you guys know anything about uh, Sheraton, just let me know. But he's fairly knowledgeable on uh, the Sheridans. That's one of his favorite pipes. Okay, story behind my pipes, or most of my pipes, is uh, Brenda saw that I was getting really interested in smoking pipes. She figured she'd cut me off at the pass before I started spending uh, some of the, the prices for these pipes that I wanted. Uh, so <laughs> she reminded me that her father had a whole bunch of pipes and I needed to go through his pipes. So we went over to... Uh, her mother's house and and uh, I picked some of the pipes I liked and brought them home and they were they were dingy dingy pipes I mean bad they were they had all kinds of gunk around the the stems y'all bought pipes on eBay y'all know how it is when they just get put up and not used for 20 years well that's what happened to these pipes uh, the country squire pipe uh, actually that that's how I found the store was this pipe uh, Brenda was saying, you know, that she knew her, her dad went to this store all the time, but she couldn't remember where it was, but she described the store exactly. So I went online when I was doing uh, investigations, <laughs> you might want to say, on uh, <clears throat> my other pipes, just seeing, you know, just for me, how much they were worth. Uh, some of these pipes are worth a good little bit. Some of them are. That Sheridan's worth a good little bit. This one, it's not really worth that much other than for sentimental value. Uh, but anyways, uh, typed in the name Country Squire because I didn't know if maybe that was the name of the pipe 
or the maker, maybe there was somebody out there named the Country Squire. And the shop here in Jackson came up. So I went to, to the store and uh, started shopping there. Great guys. I, I, Y'all seen my video, JD? He's awesome, man. He, 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 knows his, he knows his tobacco, knows his flavors. And I think I'm going to try to get with him and uh, make my own blend and own, my own English with a little bit of aromatic in it. That way when I'm out, people can smell it and uh, think it smells good. Anyways, uh, man, Cobbon, Ben, congratulations on your 200 subs, dude. You you well deserve it, and I hope you get many, many more. Uh, before I leave, y'all, I'm going to show you this little guy. This another Colin Bone. He, he'll enjoy this. It's my little old miss known. But my daughter, Kate, made me a little church warden pipe out of clay that she has. Painted it for me and glued it in his mouth. It's pretty cool. Uh being a hotty toddy but anyways guys with that we'll let you go god bless love you guys peace remember what i always say smoke them if you got them